All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duel. So today is Friday. That means that we are playing uh, some kaiju, some pure kaiju. Not the greatest of decks, but hey, what are you going to do, right? So uh, I kind of feel like more of an aggressive variant. Probably Shinju's would be best, especially with, you know, drowning OPS mirror force. I mean, tell, you can't tell me that that card is just not like a blowout card. It's like you go in and you get wrecked. Oh, I said, is this actually Chrono Valley's or? <laughs> like, hello? <laughs> Alright, so, I'm not sure if there's anything that I really want to do. I think I just might take it slow. You know, play play Waterfront, set this, play my card card D, draw a couple of cards. I think I think that's actually what I want to do. You know, just take it slow. I could blow them out and do kaiju plays, but I think I'm okay for right now. Wow, so you assume that I'm going to special summon, so you're just going to go ahead and pick that neck. I'm not going to summon shit. Like, no, man. No, man, I'll take it slow. Card card D. So I'll go ahead and plus one while you neg. How's that sound? How's that sound? And I'll get the counter. And I get the counter. How's that sound? Sounds pretty good, right? Go ahead and take that neg from me. Run two car card Decide to throw it in since sometimes you take it slow so you don't summon shit or your opponent doesn't have any monsters to my card card D draw or they make me go first and freaking kaijus. Like, all right, I don't want to go first. Infinity dot deck, dude. I'm running kaijus. Like, ah, come on. <laughs> Ain't shit to me. <laughs> Infinity dot deck. <laughs> go ahead and increase your chrono. Oh shit, what the fuck was that? Oh. A cute, oh, both of his monsters just like left the field and inherent summon. Look at you think or something. I was thinking like, you don't want to tuners. I forgot, I completely forgot about Fortress. Anyway, uh, talking about today, my uh, my birthday aftermath. So, uh, how was my birthday? Because you guys, oh, thank you guys for all the birthday wishes. Oh my god, I spent so long. Facebook, uh, YouTube, this guy just. Oh my god, like the, the, the love was flooding in, but I really do appreciate it. Thank you guys for, you know, all the support and all of the love. But uh, how was my birthday? You're probably wondering, because, you know, I recorded Wednesday's Daily Duels on my birthday, so you're probably wondering, how was the birthday? Quiet and bland. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, straight up, you wouldn't realize it was my birthday, because I really didn't do anything outside of my norm, you know? What I do on my birthday? Well, I recorded YouTube videos, I did my homework, I, you know, I, I did the usual. I, <laughs> to, to say that I did anything out of the ordinary is definitely not true, so. So we'll go ahead and just get my search on. I don't know who I want, though. I mean, it's always nice to get more kaijus. You can never have enough kaijus, right? But I guess I'll go ahead and get Gamma Seal, and then I'll go ahead and summon Gamma Seal to your side of the field. Because you don't need that. And then, how do you like it when I have a nice and powerful affinity S monster? <laughs> ah, I kind of knew you were going to do that. I kind of knew you were going to do that. <laughs> no, I don't want to set this because this might be that might be a twin twister. I'll set this. I can't. I can't really do anything with this because I already special summoned. So. I really don't need multiple of this, you know. I've been trying to do like some synchro plays with the deck, you know, synchro summon with your kai your kaijus, but it really hasn't been working out. Like I tried I tried with the pure kaiju, but it is not oh, and I gave you something to go ahead and special summon Cyber Dragon, so that's good. And throw your geki at me? Sure. Sure, I am kinda of wondering what you thought it was. Like sure geki. Like no. <laughs> I take that twenty one, that's fine. Next time, next turn, I'm just gonna go ahead and summon Gamma Seal over your ass unless you have another strike. You know? Goodness sakes, I'm not even set the fucking card card D. Like, like, nigga, I don't give a fuck. Let me go ahead and get another search. Like, every turn I get to go ahead and get a search. Search, 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 search. <laughs> so, let me go ahead and summon that Gamma Seal to your side of the field. You got another strike? No? Alright. Remove Brainwashing. Give it back. I give it to you. Give it back. Give it back. Give it back. Give it back. And if you, and if you play this to stop this, Right, you can negate my shit. I completely, you know what, I forget about that. I forget about that. I forget about that. I often forget about that, that that uh, that he can use my counters. God, I often forget about that. Uh, that that's, that's just bad. Caught you playing on my turn. I kind of wasted my remove brainwashing. I was like, oh yeah, I'll, I'll go ahead and then I'll take it back. Like, if I would have played remove brainwashing first, but hey, hey, you live and learn, right? That's what Sonic taught us, live and learn. This is one of the targets, right? Ooh. I was about to say, like, do you actually have something? Because you're kind of running out of resources here. Is this Instafusion? No. Alright. <laughs> I was thinking, I was like, oh shit, I'm like, oh shit, now it might be Instafusion. So, 
I just keep getting searches. Like, might end up summoning him depending on if something happens to him. Like, ah, I'm just gonna go ahead and take it slow. I mean, if I wanted to, I could summon Jet and then go into what Star Eater. Yeah, I could go into Star Eater, but that's weaker. Like, it's a hundred points weaker for nothing. Like, I'm okay. I'm okay. Um. Oh, it's quiet. You won't even realize it was my birthday. Outside of just, you know, all the birthday wishes and stuff like that. It's just the usual. And I wanted a quiet birthday, you know? Uh, I mean, it's not to celebrate, it's just 22. You know? yeah, it's not like you can... You know, when I, when, I, when I turn 21, yeah, you know, I think for the first... Oh, yeah, the first time. All tied up. Like, yeah. Uh, for the first time in my life, I drank some alcohol, and that was... That was fun, I guess. Well... You know what? I might just go ahead and summon the card card D and poke you with it. Like, fuck it. End this duel. I'm gonna end you with card card D, bitch. You got two set. Is it Drowning Mirror Force? Am I gonna, am I gonna get blown back? No, why? I said Drowning Mirror Force. It's like, some, you're gonna get attacked directly. You're gonna get attacked directly. So, that card just is a blowout. It really is. <laughs> Alright. That's one duel. One, one duel in this, this video. That's really all I want. I was hoping before recording. I was like, can I just win one duel? <laughs> Alright, bear back. Alright, another duel. Alright. I just love how Lithium plays the cards in the deck, and, and he just shows it off and it's just a fucking blowout. And then I try the fucking deck, and I'm just like, yeah, this, this isn't working. See? So, he made me go first, so I'll go ahead and just card card D, kind of break the rules. I wasn't really going to plan on doing much of anything anyway, so I'll just go ahead and take it slow, and then get to go ahead and break the rule of drawing. So, I drew into more cards. Oh, no, it's been wise. Oh, that's fine. Man, so he must he must be really wanting to get in my booty hole because he twin twisted one fucking macro. Of course, ultimate. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. You don't know what I'm playing though. Like all I did was car car D. He thinks maybe I'm playing something Saki. Well, I guess depends on which review of Kaju is. But no, nah, man, just car car D is the set MST. You want to go ahead and blow me back with twin twister? Rather you hit my set MST than you know something that could that really matters. So, so go ahead. Go into your synchro monster, do your play, and you're like, whoo, look at my white spirit. I can go ahead and chain and hop out the way, and I'm just gonna like, here, have a kaiju. And he'll be like, what? And I'll be like, yep. <laughs> uh, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be like, here, have a kaiju. Here, have a kaiju. <laughs> and then he's gonna be like, no. And go ahead and MST that set card. It's probably Silver Scrap, I'm assuming. I, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> that's fine. I can allow you to keep that so you can make some fucking rank 8 play, but fuck you. Run out of resources over there, huh, buddy? I'm gonna, I'm gonna pattern out on cards. Like, I, you can have my kaiju. It's not strong enough to get over this kaiju, so that's all that matters. But damn, kaiju is like complete anti blue eyes. It's like, it's like, yeah, I got the guy who could like, hop out the way and make my shit like invincible and shit. And it's just like, I, I don't fucking care. Treat you to shit. I, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> kaiju. Uh, so you're probably wondering, uh, birthday gifts. How did how did how did birthday gifts go? I got exactly what I wanted, oh, and I didn't want anything expensive or special or nothing like that. I got exactly what I wanted. Move bridge motion. That's exactly what you need, especially when he got rid of my twin twister. Because I'm assuming he there's probably going to be a point where he's going to get rid of my jizz, and I'm just going to attribute his shit, and then burn move brain motion, give it back. So it's all good. So 33. Come on, blue eyes. You can't get over this 33 meter. Is it too strong? <laughs> or you just you just patterned on the resources so quickly that you couldn't get to anything else. Like you used a lot of cards. You went neg on the twin twister. You thought dropping in the freaking alternate. You thought that going the spirit was gonna be awesome, but I was just like, nah, tribute your shit. So not only do you not keep your spirit for anything, but you don't even get to go into your Azurai's to go ahead and summon back your white spirit. It's just you, you took it. You took it to the. To the oh, and you have blue eyes in your hand, which I'm assuming you really can't do much with. All right. At least you can go ahead and summon Sage, get a search, that's nice. Yeah. Alright. And then you're just gonna leave her there to get crunched. Ah, now I do a warning. What if he has twin, another twin twister? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, I still got Gamma Seal and Radian and, you know, and that thing, so we're still okay, you know. Of course, with Blue Eyes, you'd rather do the Kaiju plays and the uninterrupt with slumber. I guess even if he chains, because I believe that the that the Azurath has to be on the field to resolve its effect first. So if you have spirit and I go and and I go uh, in an uninterrupted slumber, 
he would go, all right, chain, and they would summon it, and then you'd get hit with the, 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 the Dark Holesque effect before you can even do anything. Ooh, Polly. Polly? Oh, that's fine, I guess. I have no idea who the fuck you're Polly. Oh, Twin Burst. Yeah. That's fine. <laughs> that's fine. So, if you're not destroyed, then you go ahead and banish, right? That, that's fine. <laughs> That's, that's like totally fine. Another removed brainwashing? Like, hello? I mean, another, yeah. Uh, so I'll go ahead and just activate the brainwashing. I'll go ahead and give you Radiant. And then you can just go ahead and give it back. Thank you. <laughs> it's so good. It's just like, here. No. <laughs> I'm assuming this is the, yeah. I was, I'm assuming it was that. So I'm gonna go ahead and summon more than that, of course. I only have 3,000 life points left. If he, like, has blue eyes and Regeki's me, attaching it directly, that's a game, so. Keeping his resources down. I got a nice 28 beater, so. A little slow, though. I would gladly draw a sell and strike and you know, do all that shit, so. Can you go ahead and grab yourself a blue eyes pack or something along those lines? Yep. So, I think you have one more blue eyes left in your deck. He can't attack the turn he uses his effect. Oh, I was like, I was like, I'll gladly go ahead and draw another Solemn Strike. You mean like this? <laughs> like, ah, that's a weird duel. I haven't gotten any Terraformers or my Filth spell. They already know how good the Filth spell is for Kaiji, so. It's one more, one more attack and it's over. So you can Twin Twister if you want. I'm trying to figure out how I can end this duel. Trade in. Alright. That's, 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 that's a decently nice draw. See if you can draw into anything, anything! If I strike that, then that was not targeted, so, yeah. Yep. So, no to her, and then that's it. It's attack game. You left your stone out there, that's going to be, that's it. Ah! <laughs> Blue Eyes is so susceptible to Kaiji, it's not even funny. Alright, we'll get another duel, bear back. Alright, so, uh, you know, I didn't want anything expensive, I didn't want anything crazy. Well, Renny wants to get me something crazy, because he's like, you know, I got me a job and I got me money, so I'm gonna get you this hand shitty. Like, holy shit, this hand is shitty. And I don't wanna play anything, and I might be going against maybe a Cosmos or something. Like, like, no. Or something sacky, like, no, none of this. Like, mmm. That's not what I need either. Maybe, maybe a card card D. See? This is why card card D would be helpful. Then just go card card D and then draw, because my opponent's not doing anything. I can't do anything unless they do something. Like, holy shit. I guess we're just gonna kinda sit here and do nothing. Like, I don't want to reveal my deck yet. No. I kind of want you to do something. Like, I don't know what you're playing. There's seven cards in hand. Like, do something. Summon a monster. Do something. No. All right, pitch something. It's monarchs. Wow. So he must have just opened up the butts. Like, all right, all right. So it's monarchs, but he opened up shit. It's, he, if you were playing Monarch Monarch, he would have kicked the living shit out of me already, so. So I guess, fuck it, I guess I'll go ahead and reveal my deck. I might start poking you with Jet Synchron. I don't believe there's, is there any Monarchs, like if your opponent controls something or something like that? I don't think I believe they, there's anything like that. Like, ew. I might just leave this duel, because Monarchs are just fucking just... <clears throat> You already know I'm playing Kaijus and I still think Monarchs are just because they're, they're so high up in the meta, you know? It's just like you go to the fucking Walmart, buy three structure decks, and then you got a tier one deck, like, alright, alright, yeah, that's, that's, that's fair. <laughs> I spent all this time, I think Rennie bought freaking Cosmos for like $120, and he could still get so beat the shit out of by fucking Monarchs that you bought for $30 on Walmart. <laughs> Ordered the cards, shipped them in the mail, and everything, so. Oh, why didn't I activate this? Well, I guess it really doesn't matter. Yep. Yep, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ugh. I kinda wish monarchs would die. Like, straight up. Like, straight up get hit. Like, straight up die. At least it's a domain monarchs and not extra monarchs. That is a nice chunk out of my life points right there. 
56 right there. Like, I cannot wait for Monarchs. Yet. I've never liked Monarchs, but this, but this is what they are now. I, I, I still don't like them. So, <laughs> so that that doesn't help at all. Oh yeah, yeah. Fucking tenacity. I think pantheism and tenacity should be hit. Or monarchs on fourth. One of those three cards. You don't need to hit domain. Domain monarchs isn't even a fucking thing anymore. Like, I'm actually surprised this man's actually playing domain. The extra deck monarchs have a lot of more capability and stuff like that. And Ultimate Tilzok and Access plays are pretty nice too. Just set a card and summon Crystal Meth, because that's totally how you summon that. Getting domain. Psh, dude, I don't care about domain. <laughs> I don't give two fucks about domain. I'm just gonna take a nice chunk of damage though. That's that's just gonna go ahead and return to his hand. And I got plenty of counters. I'm gonna go ahead and summon a kaiju to his side of field, kaiju to my side of field, run over my kaiju, go ahead and switch out my kaiju for Gamma Seal, and negate, 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 negate. Oh well, of course, uh, you gotta get that ether on. That's of course gonna go back to the hand, so that's that's fun. <laughs> so alright, already got that, so I'll go ahead and get my search on. I got you, so really I just need someone who's stronger than you. Well, I guess I could summon Radiant in your place, but it's, it's really all good. But crappy. So I guess I'll go, well, I'm go ahead and activate this, of course, because I'm going to be switching out my kaijus and shit. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to negate, 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 negate. So you can go ahead and have this. Then I'll go ahead and get some kaiju counters on that. Then I'll go ahead and pick this and get some more kaiju counters. So I'll go ahead and get this and get some more kaiju counters. Counters. Then I'll go ahead and run you over. I need to run you over first. I mean, I'm assuming that uh, let's say I, was, uh, I was assuming that you're going to go ahead and do something else, but nope. So I'll go ahead and run you over. I thought you were going to go ahead and activate your ether. Run your ass over, and I'll go ahead and activate this and tag out my jizz for Gamma Seal. Yay, Gamma Seal! <laughs> That's exactly what we want, people. Nice and powerful Gamma Seal. I got Jet, I could do some secret plays, but I don't think that's necessary. So, let's see how many Monarch cards we're going to be negating today. <laughs> I mean, he's still got the full hand, you know? I still got six fucking cards, and I only have 2,400 life points. So I gotta get a nice, yeah, I got two, move two, and I believe I can do it multiple times per turn. I don't care about that. <laughs> I got a 3,000 booty. Like, oh, wait, you can attack and increase your attack. I forgot about that. But I can just tribute you and do the same fucking play. Like, if you go ahead and you can tribute summon, summon, or if it's a big half of effect, you're gonna get banished. Just wanna go ahead and tell you that right now. Right now, you are definitely gonna go ahead and get banished. No. No. Fuck that. No, you're not gonna monarch stone forth me. Fuck you. You wanna tribute your fucking prime? Tribute your fucking prime, I don't care. But, you're just gonna be 28, you're gonna probably say, the smartest thing to do is do is just tribute something, not activate your effect, and then attack over me. Nope, you activated your effect. Get fucked up. Like, don't do that. Ah, he quit! Ow! <laughs> ah, damn, he quit so fast. <laughs> it threw me for a loop, goddamn. <laughs> Alright, let me get one more duel. Bear back. Alright, last duel. And maybe the last duel for this deck. You know, polls are already up. We're starting to get votes. But no, uh, what I wanted for my birthday. I wanted uh, some silver earrings. Uh, I got those, you know, I got those. Uh, Mom said just she couldn't find them, and I was like, really? Because I can find them fairly easy. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Is that Arda's Performer Pal? <laughs> like, oh, no. You, who would have who thought that something that, you you know, Yuya, it's fucking Yuya. Who would have thought that it's fucking Yuya and be having some OP-ass shit? But Yuya has some OP ass shit. <laughs> I mean, it's the pendulum summon, so you know you, you gotta you gotta you know you gotta take what you can get, of course, you know. Yep. Yep. Go ahead and summon your sorcerer. Pop your two shit. Sorcerer needs to get hit. Like sorcerer needs to go down to one. 
Ghost Story needs to be at one. Like, I'm actually still, like, TCG. Like, I knew TCG wasn't gonna do hits farther than that. I knew that they were just gonna stick with their adjusted hits, but holy shit, this shit needs to be hit more. Like, tell me that this shit doesn't need to be hit more. Like, look at this shit. Like, it's a searcher too. Like, it's just, just you just summon it, just special summon it, you get the top two cards to get two punches. Like, what? That's fucking crazy. Like, hell no. So, uh, I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to, uh, survive. <laughs> Got that monkey board too. Like, oh my god, like, look, look at this. Look at this, people. Look at this. Oh, Rennie's calling. We're gonna answer the phone. Professionalism. Hello? Hey, what's up? Uh, getting the shit kicked out of me in Yu Gi Oh! Yeah. Can I give you a what? Oh, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Alright. Alright, bye. <laughs> like I said, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. This duel is. I'm fucked. It doesn't matter anyway, so. Like, it doesn't even matter if I MST him, because I can't fucking target this shit. Like, just magicians are so good, and fucking performer pals are so good, and the pendulum mechanic is so broken, and drowning mirror force is so broken, and fucking, <laughs> and fucking card of demise is so broken, <laughs> and this game of Yu-Gi-Oh is so broken. <laughs> oh my god. I said, maybe I can be cute. I know he's gonna pendulum with some of them, you know, these level fours right back. So maybe I can, you know, when he gets rid of this, it's like Castell or something. I could be cute and I could be like, remove brainwashing, give me back my Dogodon. Like, I think that might be fine. Like I said, it doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> but no, I got these pair of silver earrings. Mom couldn't find them, but I really went, literally went down to Walmart. I was like, look, a, a pair of silver earrings. Oh, or he can still, you know, he can also fuck up my day, so that's, that's, that's good. <laughs> yep. 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 So, I guess he's gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna get it in. I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna brainwashing. Give me back my dog around. Now who is hacking? No one! Ah, give it back! Hit <laughs> mine! <laughs> and I'm gonna kill your one. It me uh, It'd be great if I drew into like an MST next, another MST. Because I'm thinking that he might go Scott Edwards, kill his Pendulum Dragon, get a search. No, he's going to crack his own scale. Hmm. You're going to crack your own scale? I'm not allow you to do that, though. That's fine. Other odd eyes, of course. This deck is definitely going to be on a... Uh, you go to Draft League, because you already know it's fucking power. Another eight? Did you already have an eight? Doesn't really concern me. Radiant Wolf. I don't have any counters or anything like that, so. <laughs> I mean, I could tribute one of his monsters, but I mean, there's really no point, right? There's really no point at all. So, just go ahead and kill your Ignister! I'm just holding on, I'm just waiting. Kind of just waiting for him to kick the living shit out of me. I, I could give him Radiant, but Radiant's a level 7. I don't want to give him a level 7. I can give him Gamma Seal, though. I can give him Gamma Seal, and just in case he gets rid of my fucking Dogra. Oh, I would get this back immediately anyway. Actually. Cause, no, because I can only control one Kaiju. So, no, I wouldn't. Right. You can only control one Kaiju. Yep. Yeah, so, that, that's fun. <laughs> Wow, he's just cracking the shit out of his scales. Getting them searches, though. Out of his fusion. Like, okay. Look at that. Look at that. Still got fucking resources for days. I really wish I could do something about that, but I can't do shit about that. What's the mine? And Dragon Pit, Pop. So, from Performer Pals over to fucking, uh, uh, over to Magicians. Doesn't matter. I mean, they're both really great. And you slap them together, and it's just like, all right, you ready to fucking spread that booty hole? Spread them cheeks, like, alright, I guess. <laughs> Bye, world. Yep, go ahead and get your insight back. You might be able to use it later, of course. Like, will you just please beat beat me, alright? It's 
just another move brainwashing. <laughs> that's all it was. Planet of Phoenix now too. Like that's a new card they added to the Performer Pal group. Yep. I think he's done more damage to himself than I've actually done to him. <laughs> oh, Omega, so you can go ahead and put two in that? Okay. You gotta punch him something, man. You gotta you gotta you gotta jump the living shit out of me, probably. Well, I'm about to say probably big eye, but remove racial washing, so. Yep, 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 yep. I, I don't understand how Konami thought this was fair. How they thought that you could just keep on summoning these monsters back and jump the shit out of your opponent. Like, any card that has this mass jumping has been hit. Fucking Return for Different Legends, Souls Charge, you know, you know all, all them fucking cards, right? Mass summoning, jump the shit out of you, they've been hit. Yet, Pendulum Summon is okay. It just doesn't make any fucking sense. Like, it really doesn't. Like, it really doesn't. I'm assuming you kind of fucked that up. You thought I was gonna leave the, that you were gonna get him back? Like, no. Cause all you had to do was just spin fucking Dogaran, trying to be fucking cute now, but. No, you probably won't even game me, cause you look like you're about to fuse these two into like Vortex. And Vortex will bounce me, attack, 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 that's not game. So, all you had to do was cast down my fucking Dogodon. Instead, you fucked up, so. Damn. Damn, I mean, it's not like it takes skill to play fucking pendulum based decks. You just play the scales and summon. And then they die, and then you summon. And then you quit! Nigga! Oh my god. Mmm. Mmm. All you had to do was cast down. That's all you had to do was cast down my Dogon. That's all you had to do. It said you wanted to get cute and thought if you got rid of my moon brainwashing that you'd get control of my Dogon again. I'm like, no, it's mine now, but. Mm, mm, mm. Wasn't able to feel to finish resolving the effect or anything. Good job. Good job. And then you just quit. Then you just quit. So let me finish talking. So I got the parasail earrings. Uh, I literally bought them for $10 because it's all I wanted. Uh, that's what I wanted. And, you know, I was like, pay me back $10 a month, probably not. Uh, but she got me something else. The other thing that I wanted is uh, I had a watch that I like. I like wearing my watch, but I couldn't because my battery was dead. So literally, all I asked for my birthday was a new battery in my watch. <laughs> like, look at the, look at this simple shit. Look at the simple shit, the simplicity. You know, uh, Renny wants to get me a pair of beads, which is fine. You know, you know, I, I need a good pair of headphones because I'm always breaking my headphones. So I pretty much need a nice pair of expensive headphones that don't break. So. It's worth the, you know, it's worth the purchase. So, and he's like, I'll, I'll get you those. So, that's cool. So, and he's going to give me beats. It's probably the, the big gift uh, for my birthday. Um, uh, those are really, that's, that's really it. You know, that's, it's just those three things, you know. And I, you know, the beats, that's the last thing. But, you know, a $10 pair of earrings and a battery in my watch. You know, of course, banana pudding. Like, before you guys even asked, did you get the, of course I got the fucking banana pudding. Oh, my God. Love me some banana pudding, like holy shit! <laughs> like I, I, I get it from my birthday. I'm saving. I only had one, one square banana pudding. I'm savoring it, savoring it. Of course, I gotta eat because you know it can spoil really easily with the bananas and all that. But you know, I'm savoring it. You know, I'm not gonna just gulp it all down. Pause. But uh, uh, yeah, I got my banana pudding. Uh, my mom made, I guess, one of my favorite dinners. Yeah, it's one of my favorite dinners. I wouldn't say it's my favorite. My favorite is, is, is hamburger and fries, but. Uh, she made like these stuffed chicken rolls. It's like it's like it's like chicken with stuffing inside. It's pretty it's pretty good. And gravy. It's it's pretty good. We don't have it that often, so she generally likes to make it on my birthday. Cause yeah. So that was that. Uh, outside of that, it was just a normal day. I'm just recording YouTube videos, doing homework. Went to bed, woke up, and it wasn't my birthday anymore. You know, we didn't party. We didn't have cake because I don't like cake. You know, I hate cake. I hate cake. Like holy shit. Uh, I don't like chocolate, I don't like cake, so, you know, what I have, banana pudding. <laughs> so, but no one wants to touch my banana pudding because, you know, they're like, it's for Daniel. You know, he's the banana pudding guy. Anyway, that, that's pretty much it. I mean, the, the title's called Birthday Aftermath, which is not really much of an aftermath, it's really, nothing really happened. <laughs> like, you wouldn't even realize it was a special day. Like, uh, for some reason, my mom, she feels that I should thank her for my birth. So every one of my birthdays, I give her flowers, right? So on her birthday, I got her flowers. And Mother's Day, I don't get her shit for Mother's Day. I don't do Mother's Day. She knows that I don't do Mother's Day, all right? Because this is how I feel about the Mother's Day, all right? Why should you have a set day to appreciate your mother? 
when you should appreciate your mother every day, right? So I told my mom straight up. She's like, "Oh, I just want a good Mother's Day." I'm like, "Oh, you want a, you want a nice Mother's Day? All right, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna give you the best Mother's Day ever. I'm gonna treat you like crap the other 364 days of the year. That way, Mother's Day. Well, I guess 365 because we have leave here this year. That way, Mother's Day will be all the better, right? Because wouldn't your Mother's Day be awesome? Because I, I that's the only day that I treat you normally, and the rest of the days I treat you like crap. That way, you can appreciate Mother's Day. <laughs> no, I don't do Mother's Day. She knows I don't do Mother's Day. We don't do that. But I'm not thank you for flowers. So went down to the store, bought her some flowers. Uh, you know, she asked if me I could uh, get some beers for uh, for Melvin. That's fine. You know, I'm 22, not 21. So, you know, went down to 7-Eleven, <laughs> showed the ID. The ID person looked at the ID. They, you know, they probably just looked at the year because they, or maybe they looked at the day and then realized it because it's my birthday. But they probably didn't realize it. They didn't say shit. And I said, I didn't do shit for my birthday, and that's exactly how I wanted. Didn't do shit. <laughs> But uh, seriously, thank you guys for uh, all the birthday wishes. Really appreciate it. Uh, but you know, that's not the only uh, big thing uh, for the channel. Of course, I'm still working on the Guilty Draft League and all of that. Uh, we got all the you know, if you guys want to update on how's it going, we have all the people. Like all the people are confirmed. That's great. Now I just need to go ahead and you know start working on the art and you know the tr the, the the hopefully viral spamming send it to all big youtubers everybody gets to upload video like last time i'm hoping to maybe get to like 3,000 subs off this like that that's my goal that's my goal for season two to get up to 3,000 subs that's if and only if people are interested you know i mean i feel like my channel is great and i got the content but yeah um uh talk to the previous champion of Ryan, so we're gonna get that set up and uh we should like i said we still should be, should be starting it in july but uh Something that a uh, big event for the channel that's coming up, but I have nothing planned as uh, I believe on Monday, Monday the 13th, this upcoming Monday. Uh, that is the channel's four year anniversary. Yes, people, four years. So I don't know, I don't have anything special planned, <laughs> but uh, because I've just been so busy with homework and you deal to your draft league and Dragon Ball Z League, that's almost over. So I've just, I've just been swamped. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. If you haven't, uh, been to the polls already make sure you go to the polls and vote for which decks you want to see from june to july um like i guess i don't i don't see pure kaiju's doing well and personally i wouldn't mind this deck going because it's kind of slow and if you're going to do kaiju's i'll do something like you send you kaiju's but yeah but uh yeah go ahead and vote and we'll go ahead and see what decks are uh on daily dose for the upcoming week so anyway thanks for watching